Yesterday, I tried an experiment. There's something that I've been no enjoying, and that is, see when me, now this is going to sound dead, uh, like I'm following myself, like I think I'm pure fucking famous or something, but I can get recognised when I go about in Glasgow, right here. And I like when people come up to me and say hello to me, or say hello to me in, in passing, or come up and talk to me, or want a photo, or anything like that. I like that. I don't just, I'm not just like, all right, where? I like it. I like it. I don't just tolerate it. I like it. I like when that happens. What I don't like, though, is see if I'm in like a restaurant or something like that, and there's somebody air there. And I kind of like that. That, that, that annoys me. It's just, it's, it's the, it's the sneakiness I don't like. I have, uh, as I've said before, as I've said before, I'm not making it up. It's no paranoia. There was the time where I was sitting, what's that, I Cafe in Woodlands Road. I was sitting in there, I was writing, and there was these lassies outside sitting at a, a table, and one of them sort of joined them. And I was the, I didn't look, but I had a feeling the, the one that was sitting down was kind of facing me. And I was that like, used to people kind of spotting me that I thought, is she going to go like that? Like that? And I just felt what was the kind of white air face sort of like looking towards me out the corner of my eye. I wasn't sure. Next time, I know I've told this story before, right? Next time I looked, she was kind of like that. And I was like, did she just take a picture of me? Pretending to be uh, speak, uh, be speaking to somebody. I wasn't sure if I was para. I got tweeted that picture. I got tweeted the picture that was taken a couple of hours later. I don't even think it was the person who took the picture. I don't think it was, oh look, I took a picture of you. It was like by somebody else, as if somebody showed somebody else and then, and then they, they tweeted me. So there's all that, and I've seen this, I've seen somebody like that. In fact, um, about a month ago, I was in this sort of restaurant, a hotel kind of place, pub, party, a uh, hotel, and I was sitting there, and I saw, I walked past this guy in a lassie, and they were like that. I saw him kind of like that, right? And then as I was sitting down, I saw the guy take a picture of his girlfriend, which was kind of in my direction. So here's the girl, so he's like that. Or she was, I can't remember who, which side, like that look. As if taking a wee picture of their, their, their partner, like that. Like that. And I was like, you're fucking at it. And I walked up to the bar to get something. And as I was walking, they kind of looked at me. And I said, are you taking a sneaky picture of me? They're like, oh, oh no way. <laughs> you caught me. Can I get a picture? No, that. Right. Um, it was risky. It was a risky move. But they had looked at me and they were kind of smiling. So I thought, it's all right. As opposed to if they were like that. And if I said, are you taking a sneaky picture? They could have been like, you fuck, no. No. Because they could have been taking a picture of me, who they hate, to say there's that fucking prick Lemmy. Do you know what I mean? Um, anyway, I've got into the habit of uh, wearing a cap. I, I kind of like wearing a cap anyway, but I've got into the habit of wearing a cap because see if I'm going past, imagine, some 20-somethings up the toon or teenagers or something, at a time when I don't quite want to get recognised, if they were to recognise me. I mean, you saw that video when I went up Buchanan Street, right? I might not want that situation to happen. Um, if, I'm not saying that happens all the time, but it potentially could. Remember, 
Um, when the cap all I need to do is this. I just need to look down the fucking cap the, the you know that covers my face. That's it. But it's it's maybe got a wee bit out of, out of, out of hand because me, Lynn and Daniel were at a restaurant all night. It's quite a wee one, quite a wee restaurant, and we're at it all night. And I'm up with the cap on, and and it's kind of sitting next to this sort of, like these guys here, and I'm kind of facing that way. And I do a lot of this. Can I sit there, some sort of facing the wall, you know, with my back to them, and I'm kind of like that because, as I said, I don't. I, I like when people go like, oh. Uh, especially that see in a restaurant or something, it gets it out the way if they were going to, if they were and uh, recognised me and looked at me, it gets out the way if they want to take a picture or anything like that. I know this sounds pure, like, oh, poor fucking you, but um, it's just the feel I get stared at or listened to. There's Lemmy who plays Falkenhoof eating think I'll look at his mouth. I don't know. And it's it's just got, got to a point where I'm like, pure, pure fucking hiding. To the point it's kind of affecting me. And I'm just like that, right, listen, the best thing for all these sorts of things, a lot of these things, whatever it is, is exposure therapy. Whatever you're worried about, dive in it even more. Whatever you don't like, start to like it. Uh, expose yourself to even more. Um, maybe even gamify it. Gamify it. Yesterday, I went out for a cycle, and I went like, right, no cap. In fact, rather than no, like, try to no get spotted or uh, don't want to cycle past them, they might go like, ah, you know, say, you know, something like that, right? No cap. Not only that. You must, before you come home, have three interactions with people. I mean, you must be recognised three times. Three times. And not just recognised like this. I hear behind me, that was Lumbedale. It's got to be, all right, or, you know, oh, let me, like that. It's got to be that, that, you know, not, you know, wave or say hello back. It's got to be that three times. Three times. To expose myself to the kind of irrational, because it's kind of irrational sort of feel, because anytime anything happens, I don't like the kind of these sneaky sort of photo things. It's fucking rare. It happens like once a fucking ye year. No, it happens but once a si maybe every fucking six months or something. General paranoia that person sitting next to me kind of recognises, maybe listening. Um, but in general, the out and about thing, nothing. It's not like, oh, uh, every 20 times I get recognised, somebody fucking hooks my jaw. It's all fucking fine. Um... So I've just sort of got more and more fearful and a bit kind of rational bit. So I thought, right, you need to you need to do the opposite now. You need to get into it. Um, so I wanted to get uh, three interactions. You know how many happened? Seven! Seven! I was at the Clyde side. At the Clyde side, kind of uh, Merchant City, Trongate, sort of, well, not Trongate, but kind of near Glasgow Greenway. And across the road, guy like that. Lummy, no way! Kind of like that. I went, alright. I thought, that's one. Honestly, I was going like that. I need to get three before I can go up the road. I, 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 I fucking, uh, there was that. Making all this up. Fucking, fucking, fucking making this up. Making this up. Do you want me to show you the fucking the Cannon Street video to remind you? It's a lovely guy. Come on. Remember? 
Uh, Jimmy and Baxter Craig, Daryl, Vince Carmel thinks the subs. That's literally an ego trip. Congrats to sir. It's no, it's, uh, I know you're just having a joke. It's no me going about, going, am I still relevant? Uh, do people still recognise me? Am I just nothing now? Am I, if I went back to being like a normal person, I'm not normal. I'm special. I'm better than every cunt. No, it's to try and counter the kind of fear that I had. Aye, so, they're then cycling past uh, St. Eric's. Here's no notable, notable interactions of the seven. There was a guy next to the, the pub that Billy Connolly used to drink in. I think it was called the old... Uh, the Scotia. I think he used to drink in the Scotia bar. Anyway, outside there, there was a guy just went like that. It was near there, a guy went like that. All right. Um, cycled up. Somebody else, uh, a guy in a motor said, all right. Um, there was a guy that I cycled past... Uh, outside that Bank of Scotland at the front of City Nick Centre. Was it there? Was it there? What did he say? That was a good one. He went like that. No, was it there? It was someone else. He went like that. He said something like this. Oh, Lemmy. I went, all right. He went, oh, nice one. Like, nice one. He said, nice one. And he, he didn't, I don't think he said nice one in response to me saying, all right, back. As if, nice one. Thanks for saying good, uh, uh, thanks for saying hello back. I think it was like, oh, let me, nice one. Like that, it was kind of on the one go, I think. Uh Seven and, and and see as I was playing this wee game, as this exposure therapy sort of thing, I thought to myself, uh, you can't come up the road, you can't go up the road unless three three interactions. Remember, it can't just be somebody going, oh, "Is that Lemmy there?" It's got to be a kind of you know, like you wave back or you say hello or something like that. Um, but see if it's a group one, that counts as your full three right away. And I thought that doesn't. That doesn't really worth it because a group one would be like, see if it's like one person. Imagine like somebody saying hello, and while you're saying hello to somebody, imagine like say a forty, somebody else comes there because of that. That counts as your lot. But I think that would only work if I did a full like five. So I'm happy with that, and 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 in a way, I'm like want to keep playing that wee game, but. Uh, So it, 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 it worked because honestly, I'm like that usually with a fucking cat, kind of doing, can I get spotted, don't want to get spotted at traffic lights, don't want to get spotted fucking anywhere, don't want to get looked at, don't want to get looked at. Um, you know, you can sort of go in and in and in and in and in and in yourself and that really, um, I was like, ah, come on, some cunt, some cunt, I need, to, I need my three. Um... So, so it's good. I don't know how desperate I would get though. Imagine if I was snake hunt, would I really just go up and down Buchanan Street like, come on, come on. <laughs>